Hi, I'm Ed Vogel. I'm a professor here at the University of Oregon in the Department of Psychology. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about some work that um, we've done recently where we were trying to characterize, um, trying to understand how people differ in how they can focus their attention. And really, there's two primary ways that we uh, as scientists have discovered over the years. You can do it in one way, and that is by orienting your attention based on your internal goals things that you want to try to do for that exact moment or that part of that, that part of the day or that part of your life. You can have goals at a, a more um, smaller scale of just finding your car in the parking lot after you went to the grocery store. Um, but on the other hand, there's another way you can focus your attention and that is by having events in the world sort of capture your attention. So when you're um, driving uh, your car on the street, if you hear a siren, you've got this salient, um, you know, bright lights that are flashing, you've got this really loud noise, and that's going to pull your attention, even though you weren't looking for it or expecting it, it wasn't part of your goals. And what we're essentially interested in is, well, how good are different people at being able to um, resist sort of attentional capture by that external world that's trying to pull us away from our goals and to get back to what the task is at hand.